Daddy Cook. Mm -hmm. Hey, y'all remember me? <laughs> I'm back. Big Daddy is back, so Daddy can cook. I'm back from uh, the land overseas. I'm back here for a while, y'all. I gotta apologize. I'm sorry it's taking so long for me to get a video out to you. I flew in and found out. Just a second. I found out that a very, very uh, good friend of mine, Mr. Alan Britt, friend of mine, he passed away the day I flew in. So the reason I haven't done a video is because I had to take care of those responsibilities to a very good, close, personal friend. So guys, yeah, give your uh, your thoughts and your prayers to his family. He was a great man, great warrior, uh, and he will be missed. And then after that, then uh, I had my brother, my oldest brother, James Jr., because my daddy's name James, that's why he's a Jew. Y'all know that shit. Anyway, he came in, he's right over there, say, hey, YouTube. Hey, YouTube. I might let you see him later. Anyway, he came in, his birthday was on the 4th. My wife's birthday, my beautiful wife, who's right back there, who you won't see, because her hair ain't done, and she'll kick my ass. Her birthday is today. So happy birthday to my beautiful wife, Kimberly. Everybody say happy birthday, send your comments. We like that shit. Anyway, happy birthday to my brother and to my wife. Um, I can tell you how old she is because once again, this will be my last video if <laughs> I did. <laughs> All right, guys. Anyway, you saw the title. This is the bloody butt. I know you're wondering what that is. The bloody butt, y'all, is very simply. I got two pork butts. I'm injecting them with some uh, Bloody Mary mix. I season them with some. Uh, I'll show you the supporting can, and I'm gonna smoke them until they're done, guys. We're doing pulled pork. All right, guys. So the supporting cast looks a little something like this. I got my two uh, Boston Bus already prepped. I will show you the footage immediately after this supporting cast. All right, guys, uh, I did the prep already. I couldn't wait, I was running out of time, so I went on and did the prep. I'll show that to you real quick. All right, guys, I got the Bloody Mary mix. I got some Tango Joe's. Uh, I can't think of the name of it, sorry, Joe. Southwest Sunset, smells heavenly in here. Obviously, I use the mustard as a binder to hold my uh, rub on. And then we're doing pulled pork sandwiches with some coleslaw and some ciabatta bread. Too easy. All right, guys, so uh, I'm going to let you guys see this prep, how I got to where I am now, and I'll go out and start the fire. I'll be right back.
Hey! <laughs> wow! <laughs> My brother over there laughing his butt off. Who'd have thunk it? <laughs> anyway, y'all. Hey, YouTube. Welcome back. This is day two, as you can see, over my hack and cough and self and my change of clothes that uh, is the next day. Let me bring you up to speed. I um, put those uh, bloody butts, Boston butts, on yesterday, but it was raining, raining really heavily. We had uh, a storm come through. UDS, the ugly dumb smoker. Uh, no, not ugly, ugly dumb smoker. Hell temperature just fine, guys. Eight hours smoking got done about midnight. I knew that was going to happen because I started late. But I didn't take you guys with me because I wouldn't put my camera rig out there in the rain. All right, guys? But that's where we are. Before I get into supporting cast for the uh, pulled pork sandwiches, these pulled bloody butts, <laughs> that sounds so terrible. <laughs> I got a shout out, shout out that I want to give. My friend, Dwayne Mack, the guy that did the Mac Attack video, Pickleback Mac Attack. Look that one up, guys. I can use the clicks. Anyway, uh, his grandmother, I believe it is, by the name of Mildred Anderson, he told me that she likes to see Daddy Cooks. She says, I like to hear the boy talk. <laughs> well, I'm talking to you, Miss Anderson. All right, Mildred, this is a shout out to you. I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope everything's good for you. I just wanted to say that, guy. Anyway, uh, we're gonna do this supporting cast and it looks a little something like this. All right, to make the pulled pork sandwiches, obviously, guys, I need some coleslaw. And no, I don't make coleslaw. I will one day make a video on it, but I bought this from the store. And these are my bloody butts. One butt cheek, <laughs> the other butt cheek. These guys are pulled pork, fall apart, tender. All right, guys? I'll show you the whole pulling thing here, coming up here pretty quick. And then I got some shibata bread. The shibata bread is for, uh, obviously, the bun for my sandwiches, all right guys? So let me get some prep work done, get some of the meat pulled, and I'll be right back. Be all pulled and everything's good to go. The next thing we're gonna do, guys, is uh, assemble this sandwich. Now, since I did do this last night, I'm gonna nuke. That's microwave for some of you people. We're gonna nuke this meat, and once it is warm, I'm gonna put the sandwich together. One minute, start, and I will be right back. Now, before I do this taste test, which I'm going to do myself, um, 
the Bloody Butt Injection, the uh, Bloody Mary Injection. Uh, when I tasted the meat, and we've all tasted the meat, how's the meat, y'all? Mm -hmm. Meat is fabulous. <laughs> My brother says fabulous. He heard like David. Mm -hmm. Anyway, guys, it tastes wonderful with the smokiness of the apple wood, because that's what I use, by the way. But there are veins of where I injected the uh, Bloody Mary mix, and that's where you taste the tomato. So if I were to do this again, what I would do is inject it more and then let it marinate overnight before I put it on the smoker. I think the smoke's kind of killing the tomato taste or I just didn't put enough in there or something. This might be a do-over. But anyway, this is my sandwich. Yes, I said sandwich. All right, wonderful thing. And here's the taste test, y'all. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I think I killed myself. Mmm. <laughs> Y'all. The smokiness of the apple wood in there. Very, very light hint of the tomato. Sweet Baby Ray. And the Cold Star Classic Pool Pork Sandwich. Oh my goodness, this is so good, guys. I recommend you try it. I'm going to work on perfecting it. But I recommend you try it. All right, guys. It's good to be back. I know I've been away for a while. I'm going to shoot out as many videos as I can before I go, go away again. All right, guys. And once again, Mildred Anderson. That's your shout out the second time, y'all. My girls call me Daddy. And I cook. Good. Adam? On. Are you recording? Uh huh. Oh, okay. Well, Everything's three, on. Three, two, one. Yeah, we can't. Keep it rolling. Don't worry about it. Uh, babe, go close the door. Leave everything going. Close on the door. Quickly, we're rolling. Now that needs to stay in there. I don't Hey YouTube, welcome back, welcome back. As you can see by my dress, this is the next day. And but let me tell you what happened. We put the uh the bloody butts on. Alright, put them on a UDS love you drunk smoker. I did not let you guys see that because it was raining and it was raining something terrible. And I wasn't taking my camera rig outside in the rain. So I did smoke them. All right, roughly about uh, 275, because I, I cooked them a little bit higher. I smoked them roughly uh, 275 for about eight hours. Um, there's something weird going on with the camera and stuff. Okay. Like, it just... What? Like, it just started turning green, started flickering, and then it stopped. I think it's a monitor, though, and it's not getting power. Oh, the battery died. Kill everything. We still recording? Cool? That's off. Good. Yes. Oh, look, keep talking. One, two, three, four, five. <sighs> there's What's... something wrong with Sam. Oh, let's see. Audio. I pressed it. Test one, test maybe my microphone. Let's turn it off now. Off. Oh. Test one, test two. Uh-oh. What? No, no, wait, wait. Test I one, test two. Is it low? No, I just hear a buzz. All right, now you got the buzz. Test one, test two, you got that. Now, test one, test two. Really?
Can Daddy cook? Mm-hmm.